Hey everyone, welcome back to Headbangers React. If you're new here, I'm Gorkor, and today we're doing another requested reaction. Today's request is the band Orbit Culture. So we're going to revisit these guys, except this time we're going to check out a live in the studio track entitled North Star of Nija. This comes originally off of their album Nija that was released in 2020 on the label Seek and Strike. So the first track that I checked out by these guys entitled Saw, I enjoyed for the most part. I was a little on the fence about the clean vocals, but like every band, I want to give them another chance and I want to do your guys' requests. So let's get into this and see what they have for us this time. I definitely like these guys' heavy stuff. It's groovy. I like his guttles. I know the cleans are going to be coming somewhere there, so we'll see. Clean sound a little bit different here. Almost reminds me of James Hatfield.
So first off, thank you very much once again for the request. If anyone else has any other requests, please go to the community section within our channel and there's a post there about requests. If you post there, I will definitely get to it. You can be sure that your request will be fulfilled. If you make requests within the video comments section, I might overlook it, but I will do my best to get to them. But as the channel gets busier, that's gonna be harder to keep track of. I do try to take care of it as soon as you guys put the requests in and write them down. But if things get busier and the channel keeps growing, that's going to get tougher. So your best bet is to go to the community section of the page and post there. Thanks a lot for that. If you have a moment, please subscribe to the channel. Help us grow. We would definitely appreciate it. If you end up liking this video, then impale the like button. If you don't like it, then give it a big fat thumbs down. Either way, I just appreciate you taking the time to check out these videos. So with that being said, I enjoyed this song. I definitely love the heavy parts. I love his guttural vocals. You know, we get some groovy moments here. The drummer's sick. You know, he's doing a great job. But I am still a little bit on the fence with those clean vocals. I don't dislike them. I'm just not particularly into them. And I found on this track, the way he sings sounds a little bit more in line with someone like James Hatfield. It sounds a little bit different than what I heard on the track Saw. So this being a live track as well, maybe he just comes across a little bit differently. I don't know. I'm going to go back and check out the actual studio recording that's on the album just to hear the difference and see what the difference is and if it's sung the same. I'm just curious, but I will definitely look into more of these guys' stuff. I'm still intrigued, definitely interested. I definitely very much like elements of the band. And being a fan of bands like Fear Factory, this kind of falls in line with something like that. So I'm just a little hard on clean vocals. I'm a little on the fence, but overall, this was definitely a good track. So I'm definitely intrigued to check out more. The video obviously was studio footage, so nothing too crazy or special here, but gives you a good idea of what these guys sound like in a live environment. I'm sure there's still some studio magic going on here to make things sound better, of course. You know, it's probably not quite the same as going to a show, but then again, nowadays, shows sound great. You know, we've got good engineers taking care of the sound, and that makes a big difference. So maybe this is pretty spot on. I'm not too sure. Maybe I'll check out some more live stuff to see how that is. That being said, if you enjoyed this band, definitely check check out their other materials, support them like any band that you enjoy. And once again, thanks so much for checking out this video. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Hopefully we'll be back for the next one. Stay sick, everybody. Cheers.